Hi, this is New with a minute of medicine for your mind. You know, about 23 years ago, I got myself in some trouble and I thought I was down for the count. But after the smoke cleared, there I stood, you know, not even smelling like smoke. Matter of fact, I made some new allies and helped me get a brand new start, a fresh start in life. But the people I was connected with didn't like it. As a matter of fact, somebody said to me, man, I can't stand you. Nothing ever happens to you. Man, you get away with everything. And that hurt my feelings, but it also hurt something else inside of me that I didn't realize until a few years ago. Because up until then, I never felt like I really deserved deserved any of the good things that were happening in my life, even if I worked for them or if they were given to me by favor. That's because I didn't understand how God's favor works. You see, what I'm trying to say to you is real simple, see? God's favor is not fair. He gives it to whoever he wants to give it to. It's his business based upon his plan. You see, and whether we think that person deserves it or not, it's not up to us. One, we don't have a heaven or hell to put anybody in. And two, we can't even explain or understand the complexity of God's plan. You see, think about it. What if you're paid for your house? For 15 years and somebody comes up to you and says, they just blessed me with a house and they didn't have to pay a dime. Or you paying your $400 car note and somebody said, man, they just gave me a car. Or you paying your student loan and somebody said, man, they just gave me a scholarship and they weren't even thinking about going to school. Those things can bring up some feelings inside of you. See, what I'm saying is that favor can yield you more haters than it can friends. But you need to focus on the task that you are supposed to get done because of that favor. If not, then you can get locked in that same cycle that I got locked in and not realize that you deserve all that God's given to you because he said so. Haters will come because of favor, but that's no excuse for you not to realize that you deserve to live greater. This is new with a minute of medicine for your mind.